Um, I guess since we're rocking with purity this month, uh, I say if you're young in your relationship, stay pure until marriage. If, okay, if you look back at the people you've been with and you look at the person you're standing, getting married to, you kind of, they kind of just look small compared to them because she's the one you're going to end up being with and those just look tiny. Yeah, as you can tell, I've not been practicing at all. Um, emotional baggage, that's where, like, okay, say you're going on a date with a girl, and you really like her, but then at the end she's like, well, I don't want to date you because I've been hurt by this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this goes on. And you're like, okay, those guys, me. Those guys, me. <laughs> like, you're kind of wondering, why would you give these guys a chance and not me? Well, it's because she's afraid that she might get hurt again, which is completely understandable. But, ah, one reason to stay here, I got this in my head now. I know what I'm talking about now. Um, first person, the yeah, reason we should stay here. The first person you sleep with, they're gonna have a part of you forever. Not you may think, well, first time, it's okay, I want to get rid of it, get it done, bye, done with it. No, that's stupid. It, I'm going to say, no, that's stupid if you want to lose it just because it's cool. It's the thing. Everybody's doing it. Well, good for everybody else. You know, that's, you live for him, not them. Him. So, the person you should sleep with first is the person you should be with forever. I mean, I mean, because I, I'm one of those people, I'll admit it, I, but I don't, I've grown to grips with it. I just don't see why everybody sees sex as such an amazing, like, it's been downgraded so much. You turn on the TV, you can't go five minutes, ten minutes without seeing a commercial with women in bikinis or I'm in court, but I don't know, you should change your channel after that, but I just don't, it, sex is supposed to be like a pure thing, like just for a married couple, for people that are in love and know that it's just amazing to be with each other and they have a relationship for a God. And now it's just, you've been together for three months, so you're already in the room. I guess I don't see why it's such a big thing nowadays. Uh, I agree. Mean, uh, Alright folks. What I believe Gibby is trying to say here, and uh <laughs> Hello. Gibby's trying to say that sex is an amazing thing. It is a beautiful thing. And those of you that are married, those of you you know, God created this awesome, amazing thing. He created it to be something special. 